So this week things calmed down a little bit at the church. I believe we have a service Wednesday evening, although I can't remember what it is. I think it might be the Archivist of the Inexhaustible Cup, which is a service that we offer on behalf of people that struggle with addictions. And so if you'd like to come to that, you can sign up. And it is the Archivist? Yeah. And then next weekend, we'll have our usual weekend schedule. Um, in a couple of weeks, uh, the first weekend of September, I am planning to go uh, to Denver to visit uh, my, my friend, you probably might remember my friend Father James who passed away. Um, his daughter, one of his daughters is getting married in September and so we're going to go to Denver for the wedding. And so that weekend, um, I think it's September 4th and 5th maybe, um, I'm going to look into finding coverage. We may not be able to find coverage. If I can't, we'll, we'll just, we'll, we'll, I talked with Father Andrew, I talked with George, that we'll just not have services um, for that one weekend. Uh, normally, Father Andrew, as well as myself, and I'm still really, he's reluctant about it, I'm really reluctant about it, but given the situation with COVID and all this other stuff, it's kind of, you know, do we really want to be moving people from Phoenix up to here, and you know, it's it's. Uh, so at any rate, I am going to look into it to see if I can find coverage. But if I can't, um, there won't be any services that weekend. And um, and if I can find coverage, we'll probably only have divine liturgy on Sunday. I would assume. So no liturgy, no liturgy on Saturday. Um, so I appreciate your prayers for our safe travels, that we remain healthy, you know, and all of that when we go, and uh, uh, and just for for Karis, and I can't remember the man that she's marrying, I can't remember what his name is, <laughs> um, but pray for them, you know, that God would bless them as they prepare for their wedding, and uh, and the Ferrezo family, um, all of them, so, okay, I think that's it, do you, do you have any announcements for us? Yeah.
days from, and then after it would be lost. And like, there would be days it's like, I can't do it anymore. Um, but somebody would pop up, or they would be prayers. <laughs> and, um, sorry, um, I was going to write this out, but anyways, I just want to thank you so much for your many kindnesses and your prayers, and especially to Father Jeffrey for modeling kindness and patience <laughs> and love. And if our church is supposed to be the hospital, then I think the hospital for the soul, then I think God would be very pleased with the Jeff Curry Medical Center. <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, thank you. I stumbled through that. But I just wanted to thank you all very much. Thank you, Liz.